Hello, this is Kenneth Wong, contributing editor for Desktop Engineering Magazine. It was only a few weeks ago that we got a glimpse of the first 2D sketch and paint application from PTC, distributed for free under the Creo brand. Well, this week PTC comes out swinging again, this time with a free direct editing application called Creo Elements Direct Modeling Express. Boy, I think I'm going to call it Creo Direct Express just to save our time and breath here. If you have used PTC's direct modeling program called CoCreate, you'd recognize the elements in the interface, most notably the Copilot control arrows for moving and rotating features and faces. You might think of Creo Direct Express as a trimmed down version derived from CoCreate's direct modeling technology. The software allows you to push, pull, rotate and move faces and features with little or no concern for feature history or parametric history. There is a certain freedom that comes with that approach to modeling, particularly in conceptual design phase. The direct modeling approach extends to 2D sketching as well. The software is quite good at guessing your desired constraints. So if you push lines and arcs around in 2D, you'll find nearby segments reshaping according to how you're moving the geometry. In Creo Direct Express, part modeling and assembly modeling are just a tab away from each other with little distinction. You can, for instance, create a new part right within the assembly environment, draw your sketch and extrusions to close approximation to how you want the new part to fit with the existing one, then use the alignment commands to define the precise alignment or mating position. There are advantages to this method as well because it's a lot easier to design a new part that interlocks with an existing part if you don't need to start a brand new window every time you start a new part. At the moment, the software's import or 3D reading function is limited to neutral formats mostly, so you won't be able to, for instance, open a SolidWorks Inventor or Solid Edge file in a native format. You'll have to bring it in as IGES or STEP file. The software also has the option for realism enhancement. It's a visual style that shows ground plane reflections, shadows, and rendered surfaces on your design. I think Creo Direct Express is another piece of evidence that PTC is following through on its promise to drastically reform its approach to CAD and PLM, shifting from an all-inclusive hefty package to a series of modules with specific purposes. For quick concepts in 3D or quickly reshaping imported 3D CAD data through a neutral file format, Creo Direct Express offers more than enough functions, far more than what you might rightfully expect to get from a free program. There is, however, a limit to the number of parts you can work with in assembly mode. It's 60. This limit obviously disappears once you upgrade to the commercial version. The commercial version gives you also sheet metal tools, along with decal or embedding 2D images in your design, photorealistic rendering, and exporting step in IGES files. In my view, Creo Direct Express is a worthy rival to existing direct modelers now in the market, like Autodesk Inventor Fusion or Solid Edge with synchronous technology. And the software does have one serious advantage. It doesn't cost you anything. Until next time, this is Kenneth Wong expressing his 3D views in Creo Direct Express.